Hello everyone, this is Philippe. This time I would like to show you a very nice feature of OS4. I'll show you how I can delete the system partition while the system is running. Yes, you heard it well. I'll completely wipe the system partition and the system will be still running. Okay, what uh, I need is a shell. I now close all programs which are running in the background. I just want to be sure no program will try to uh, uh, read a file on the system partition while it is completely empty. Okay, this is the icon of my system partition. Okay, of course before doing that I backed up all the files on my system partition here is the backup okay now I change my system partition here is my disk here is the system partition and now I change its file system. I even change the block size of data written and I forgot this setting. Okay, as you can see the partition was changed. I now write the changes to disk and when I want to close this partition utility it asks for a system restart because the system needs to notice the changes uh, on the partition but I decide not to restart now and uh, now my system partition is not really usable and I use my backup to um, tell the system that um, changes have been applied to the, part the partition. This is done with the mounter utility and now I mount the system partition which is highlighted here. Okay, here are the, the icons and I now format this system partition. I, I want to use a format utility but of course uh, when I try to run a program it tries to uh, to find my old system partition which is not available at the moment but no problem with a tool I, I did a long time ago uh, and then I set some settings back in place. What I did now is to tell the system that um, the, um, my uh, backup directory is uh, well should be used as a a system partition. As you can see the program format program now works and I can select my system partition to format it again back to a working environment. Okay. This is the, new, the icon of the newly formatted partition. As you can see, it is empty. And what I do now is to uh, copy all my files from the backup back to my system partition. Let's go.
Okay, the copy is finished and to show you it works perfectly I restart the, the system I do a soft reboot to restart only OS 4 and here is my system which is now with a new file system as I changed it a few minutes ago. Thanks.